How to get your puppy to stop biting. Method 1. Understand Puppy Biting Behavior 1. Know how puppies learn not to bite. Young puppies often do not know how hard they are biting, and so they bite playfully without understanding how it affects others. Puppies usually learn that they're biting hard by playing with other puppies or adult dogs. Puppies will nip and bite each other playfully until one puppy or dog is nipped too hard and gives out a high-pitched yell. The victim will stop playing, and the puppy that bit the victim is taken aback and also stops playing momentarily. Next time the puppy plays, if she bites too hard and gets the same reaction, she begins to realize that her bites can actually hurt other puppies and people. The puppy uses this evidence to modify her behavior. 2. Understand the dynamics in a dog group as puppies age. Adult dogs tolerate the, sometimes naughty, behavior of young puppies reasonably well, but they become less tolerant as the puppy ages. It is as though the adult dog thinks that the puppy ought to know better. Hence, as the puppy ages, the severity of the correction from an adult dog changes from a mere change in play to a quick message that may include a growl or a snap. In more extreme cases of correction, an adult dog will jump on a puppy and pin it down on its back to really teach her a lesson, in most cases, this should not be replicated by human owners unless under direction and supervision of an experienced trainer. Due to this natural progression, puppies generally learn from adult dogs that biting is unacceptable before they are old enough to cause harm to other dogs or people. 3. Use good judgment when training. When selecting a training technique for your puppy, Keep in mind the amount of time you are able to spend on the training and the appropriateness of the training method for your situation. If you have children, it is important that the puppy understands not to bite them, but it may not be appropriate for the children to participate in the training.